gonna undo the latches. Very satisfying click. There's the impact. this into it's plugged in the light is on illuminating nice and smooth it's engaged with the lug nut. Gonna press loosen. Gonna hold it firmly so it doesn't jump out of my hand. So easy. Let's try this on the back of the car. We'll just do two or three. So impressive. You know what? Let's try it on this car. This has bigger lug nuts. I think they're 21. No, they're, yeah, they're 21. Try a couple here. Let's try. I wonder if it can take off. I think you can take off caliper bolts. It's a 17, right? It's a 17, so we put the... Will this fit in here? Oh!
Okay, let's try this axle nut. I have the 32 millimeter here. Bam! <laughs> so you know in the Milwaukee videos, the Milwaukee users say you have to unstake this nut. But for the Amazon, M Plus, M Plus don't care about your stake. It you just ripped it right out. Is that a 32? That's a 32. You know what? I'm gonna... This is a 32 as well. Let's try this. It's a Mazda. This is a 32 as well. We'll try this. Ooh. Now I know this one has been off. Um, before, I think in one of the Milwaukee videos, but I mean, it took it off. I think this is torqued to like 170 foot pounds or something. I better leave that loose. So I don't forget. Let's try tightening it. Have the torque wrench here. I'm gonna put it to one thirty. Is it one twenty? The torque wrench here. I put it to 125 to see. Put it in gear. Let's see. Oh, sh already clicking past a hundred and twenty five foot pounds.
put it to 130. Oh. It's tighter. It tightened it tighter than 134 pounds. So, I don't know. I can do it. Okay, so let's try this caliper bracket bolt. I have a deep 17. Let's try this strut, strut nut. The only thing I'd watch out is maybe getting it crimped in the door. I'd probably run it through the window just to be safe. 